Hi guys, how you doing? Welcome back to the channel. Appreciate you being here. Please subscribe, like, share, all that good stuff. Okay, before we start this video, I just want to give a shout out to my little bar competition winner of the day. And that is, boom, Miss Lucy. She cute, man, she cute. As all my boomer are, oh, you get me. All right, guys, make sure you follow her, show her love. Let's get this moving, let's get it. With a gooner on the sofa, whatever the camera can see, we can see. Alright guys, this is the Guna at Bio, and today we're talking about Miss Louise Quinn. Salute! Alright, here's some quick facts. Date of birth, 17th of June, 1990. Birthplace, Blessington, Island. Position, centre back. Number 16. And a Island International. I think we should start with the youth career. Blessington Boys FC. I love it when I'm seeing that these, these Gunarets have played for boys teams. Even though you know how the world is, or should I say, you know how the world was, that was the only place that they were really going to play. But because I know girls like this, I grew up with girls like this, I'm like, yeah you do. Yeah you do. Girls that can play with the boys can play. Trust me on that. Not to say that's their final test, but it is what it is. If they can play with the boys and hang, they can play. Salute. Louise also played for Lakeside FC. Education. New Bridge College. Amen. Okay, let's talk clubs, appearances and goals. Goals? She's a centre back. Trust me, I did the research. From 2004 to 2012, Louise played for Per Mountain United. Appearances? Don't know. <laughs> Couldn't find the number. Goals? Unknown. Couldn't find the number. 2013 to 2016. She played for es Escachuna United. Escachuna? I can't pronounce that. Let's just call it United. 90 games she played. <sighs> yeah, but let's talk goals. You're talking goals, all that stuff. You're talking goals. 13 goals. Centre back. 13 goals. Do you understand? 2017. She played for Notts County Ladies. One appearance. No goals. Then she moved to the greatest club on earth. That's Arsenal if you didn't get that. So far, the sister has made 40 appearances. 40. What, you're not going to ask about the goals? Well, from the 13 thing, I'm like, might as well just shut up then, innit? Because she's banging them in. That's what I thought. So far, the Gunnarets scored five goals for Arsenal winning team. Yes, sir. <coughs> 2008 onwards. Remember I said she was an international. She has played for the Republic of Ireland 68 times. How many goals, man? How many goals? She's a centre back. How many goals? Yo, the sister has scored eight goals internationally. Eight. Eight. There's man them that haven't scored that many goals and they're strikers. Okay, so she played youth football with Lakeside FC. Which is in Wilklow. Then she moved to a Dublin club. P Mount. That's P Mount United. She wore the arm proudly and took P Mount United to a cup final in 2008. Sadly, they lost 2 1 to St. Francis. Two years later, in 2010, the club made the final again, winning 4 2. Sadly, our Louise missed that final because she had to do a work placement in the US. What happened August 2011? What do you mean? What happened then, blood? What happened? Beautiful Guna scored a hat trick. Yeah, we might have to rename her Mrs. Arsenal at this moment. What centre back scores hat tricks? <laughs> is, it, is that even done? Does that even happen? <laughs> she scored a hat trick against ZNK Kur Kurkai Kurkai Kur Kur. Sorry, man, I, I can't pronounce these names. But she scored a hat trick. Period. <laughs> that was playing for P1, and they actually won the game seven seven nil. And the game was played in Slovakia. Slovakia. I'm having a terrible time pronouncing stuff in this video. <laughs> Which was a UEFA Women's Champions League qualifying game. <coughs> January 2013. Our lovely Louise made the move to Sweden. Where she played for United. That's right. I'm just saying United. You know the name. Eleskituna. She was a success straight away. 
hit the ground running. She got promoted in her first season, finished seventh in her second season in the top flight. In 2015, they finished runners up to FC Rosengard. Coach Victor Eriksson said this. Basically, he described Quinn as one of the best defenders in the league. In 2016, Louis proudly wear the armband for the club and played a key part in their UEFA Champions League campaign. She still decided to leave later that year. She left to join the best, the best, the best, the best. Signed a first, and she signed a <coughs> she signed a short-term deal with Arsenal on the 3rd of May 2017. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. I wonder how long short term actually is. It's 2019 now, huh? and her sister's still playing. Think she signed a long one? Do you think she signed a long one? Like Miss Daniel? Like DVD? You think? All right, let's talk that international career, baby. Whoops, I don't have an Irish shirt. Sorry, darling. That's better, that's better. Don't take no offense. Only reason why I had the Dutch one for DVD was because I actually support the Dutch national team. Let's get it. Louise captain Ireland's national team at under 19. 25 appearances plus five more caps for under 17 games. She made her senior debut in 2008, February. She was a last minute sub in a 4-1 win against Poland. In 2008, Quinn, in 2008, Louise was named, 2008, Louise was named one of the players in the 22 women squad for Ireland. This was a women's UEFA qualifying game in 2009 versus Iceland. And at the time, manager Noel King said this, I shall quote him, without a doubt, the biggest game in history of the women's football in Ireland. Arguna Rep was part of that. In February 2009, she won her second cap for Ireland, making it another sub appearance. Sadly, it was a 2 0 defeat to France. After cementing, that's right, cementing, that means that position is mine. Louise Quinn was named FAI Senior Women's International Player of the Year 2013. She's FAI Senior Women's Player of the Year. Are you insane? Salute to you, darling. Salute. That's Manguna Rep right there, international bag yeah. Quinn was also awarded the FIA scholarship to the University of Dublin. And all the Guna ladies are smart. They're all smart. Like, they're all coming out with their captain gowns. That's how they should just bop onto the field. Let man know. She represented Irish University at the World University Games, which was <coughs> which was a 2009 tournament in Belgrade. And that's it, guys. That's the little rundown of our lady from the island. The Irish lady, that's her right there. Get me, Louise Quinn, Gouderette. Make sure you show her love, make sure you show her support. Go and follow her, go and send her some love. Hit Twitter, hit Instagram, all that good stuff, man. Okay, that's Defender out the way. Who's next? Goalkeeper, goalkeeper. Who's gonna be the next goalkeeper? And we just lost one of our goalkeepers as well. Uh, but, yes. Salute to Louise Quinn, the international lady. Thank you for your service. Shout out the whole of the Arsenal women team. I got you, man. Support all day. Let's get it in. Oh, boom. Support the Gooner on the sofa. Follow on Instagram or Twitter. Bring lots of love, plenty of banter, or be blocked. Oh!